A Comprehensive Guide to Growing Abutilon Abutilon, commonly known as flowering maple or Chinese lantern, is a beautiful flowering shrub that adds vibrant colors and a touch of elegance to any garden or indoor space. With its attractive bell-shaped flowers and lush foliage, Abutilon is a popular choice among gardeners and plant enthusiasts. In this detailed guide, we will walk you through the step-by-step -step process of growing Abutilon, from selecting the right variety to caring for and maintaining these stunning plants. Selecting Abutilon Varieties Abutilon comes in a variety of cultivars with different flower colors, sizes, and growth habits. Some popular varieties include Abutilon megapotamicum, trailing Abutilon, Abutilon hybridum, flowering maple, and Abutilon pictum, painted Abutilon. Choose a variety that suits your climate, available space, and aesthetic preferences. Choosing the planting location. Abutilon thrives in well-draining soil and prefers a spot with partial shade to filtered sunlight. Choose a location that offers protection from harsh afternoon sun or strong winds. If planting a butylon outdoors, ensure the soil is rich in organic matter and has good drainage. For indoor cultivation, select a bright area near a window with indirect sunlight. Propagation methods. A butylon can be propagated through seeds, stem cuttings, or layering. While growing from seeds is possible, it is easier and more reliable to propagate a butylon from stem cuttings. Take 4 to 6 inch stem cuttings from a healthy, mature butylon plant, remove the lower leaves, and plant them in a well draining potting mix. Keep the soil moist and provide a warm and humid environment until the cuttings root and establish themselves. Planting a butylon. If planting a butylon outdoors, dig a hole slightly larger than the root ball of the plant. Place the plant in the hole. Ensuring that the top of the root ball is level with or slightly above the soil surface. Backfill the hole with soil, gently firming it around the plant's base. Water thoroughly to settle the soil. If planting a butylon in containers, choose a pot with drainage holes and fill it with a well-draining potting mix. Place the plant in the pot, ensuring it is centered and at the same depth as it was in the previous container. Fill any gaps with additional potting mix, firming it gently. Water the plant thoroughly after planting. Watering and moisture requirements. A butylon prefers consistently moist soil, but not overly wet conditions. Water the plants deeply when the top inch of soil feels dry to the touch. Avoid letting the soil completely dry out between waterings, as this can lead to stress and leaf drop. Adjust the watering frequency based on the weather conditions and moisture needs of the plant. Fertilizing a butylon. Feed a butylon with a balanced, slow-release fertilizer in early spring, just as new growth begins. Follow the package instructions for application rates and frequency. Alternatively, you can use a water-soluble fertilizer diluted to half strength and apply it every four to six weeks during the growing season. Avoid over-fertilization as excessive nutrients can lead to leggy growth and reduced flowering. Pruning and shaping. To maintain a compact and bushy shape, prune a butylon regularly. Remove any dead, damaged, or diseased branches. Pinch back the tips of the plant to promote branching and encourage fuller growth. Pruning can be done in early spring or after the flowering period to stimulate new growth and enhance overall plant health. Protecting a butylon from pests and diseases. A butylon is generally resistant to pests and diseases. However, it can occasionally be susceptible to aphids, whiteflies, and spider mites. Inspect the plant regularly and treat any infestations promptly using organic insecticidal soaps or other suitable methods. Maintain good airflow around the plant to prevent fungal diseases, and avoid overwatering, which can lead to root rot. Overwintering Abutilon In regions with cold winters, Abutilon may need protection from frost. If planted in the ground, apply a layer of organic mulch around the base of the plant to insulate the roots and protect them from freezing temperatures. In colder climates, Abutilon can be grown as a potted plant and moved indoors during the winter months. 
Place the plant in a bright location away from drafts and maintain moderate watering during this period. Enjoying Abutilon's flowers. Abutilon blooms throughout the growing season, producing bell-shaped flowers in various colors. Admire the vibrant and graceful blooms as they add beauty to your garden or indoor space. Cut the flowers for floral arrangements, but be sure to leave enough blooms on the plant to encourage continuous flowering. Growing a butylon is a rewarding experience that allows you to enjoy the stunning beauty of its bell-shaped flowers and lush foliage. By following the step-by-step -step instructions outlined in this comprehensive guide, you can successfully cultivate and care for a butylon plants. Whether in your garden or as indoor specimens. Embrace the process, provide proper care, and watch your abutilon thrive and brighten up your surroundings with its captivating blooms. Happy growing!